Dear friends in Christ, I welcome you to light your Advent candles. We're in the third week of Advent, so we light three candles around our Advent wreath today as we enter into Terse together. I welcome you to find a comfortable sitting or standing position, perhaps one where you are seated, where your feet can also be on the ground. We begin with a moment of silence. All that we owe is redeemed in the love of God. Let us pray. Wise and loving God, you bear us for joy. In humility, you show us wisdom and fold us at this hour with the knowledge born of love. Awaken within us the desire to know rightly and the will to live justly with grace and generosity. Amen. A reading from Julian of Norwich. It's called The Song of True Motherhood. God chose to be our mother in all things and so founded the work of creation most humbly and most pure in the virgin's womb. God, the perfect wisdom of all, became incarnate this humble place. Christ came in our poor flesh to share a mother's care. Christ carried us within him in love and travail until the full time of his passion. And when all was complete and he had carried us so for joy, still all this could not satisfy the power of his wonderful love. All that we owe is redeemed in truly loving God, for the love of Christ works in us. Christ is the one whom we love. A reading from Isaiah. A shoot shall come out from the stump of Jesse, and a branch shall grow out of his roots. The spirit of the Lord shall rest on him, the spirit of wisdom and understanding, the spirit of counsel and might, the spirit of knowledge and the fear of the Lord. He shall not judge by what his eyes see or decide by what his ears hear but with righteousness. He shall judge the poor and decide with equity for the meek of all the earth. Please join me in a moment of meditation. I will read for us a quote from Carlo Caretto, and then we will share in a moment of silence. The desert is always the same. The sky is always beautiful. The road deserted. The only thing that is always new is God.
Let us pray. Holy One, as we prepare for the advent of Christ, give us your spirit of wisdom. As we seek to embody your love in the world, give us your spirit of good counsel. As we seek to be faithful, give us eyes to see beyond the obvious. As we gather in this hour, we lift all our needs before you, those spoken aloud at this time and those held within our heart. May we be instruments of your peace on earth as we accept the gift of your Holy Spirit. We now voice the prayer our Savior taught us in whatever language or version you bring. Vater unser im Himmel, geheiligt werde dein Name, dein willigische, wie im Himmel, so auf Erde. Unser tägliches Brot gib uns heute, Und vergib uns unsere Schuld, wie auch wir vergeben unseren Schuldigern. Hör uns nicht in Versuchung, sondern löse uns von dem Bösen. Denn dein ist das Reich und die Kraft und die Herrlichkeit in Ewigkeit. Amen. God, whose holy name defies our definition, but whose will is known, in the freeing of the oppressed, make us one with all who cry for justice, that we who seek your praise may struggle for your truth through Jesus Christ, our living Lord and Savior. Amen. All that we owe is redeemed in the love of God. Be of good courage, good friends.